On day two of the NFL draft, Davis Mills was not the first quarterback off the board. Turns out he was the third following Kyle Trask and Kellen Mond. Mills was selected in the third round, 67th overall by the Houston Texans, their first pick in this year's draft. Got good size, 6'4", 217 pounds, got a good arm. Only made 11 career starts at Stanford, six as a junior, five as a senior. Despite an underwhelming college career, comes in with a pedigree. He was the number one pro-style quarterback in the 2017 class at 24-7 Sports. Break it down. Welcome to former Notre Dame standout NFL quarterback Brady Quinn and CBS Sports HQ senior NFL analyst Pete Prisco. Start with the quarterback Pete really likes, Davis Mills out of Stanford. Pete, what do you like about Mills and what grade are you giving the Texans with this pick? Of course I'm going to give it an A. He's my guy. I'm all in on Davis Mills. I think this is could be a good situation for him. And uh, you know, you don't want to see it quite work out that way. You'd love to see Deshaun Watson be able to play football again, but we don't know where he is in terms of everything going off on the field, and I'm not going to speculate on any of that, but uh, this gives him a young quarterback. Tyrod Taylor is there. Uh, he will, if Deshaun Watson doesn't open the season for some reason, Tyrod Taylor will be the starter, but this is a guy who, with a little more seasoning, can become a, a good NFL quarterback, and, and so I give this grade an A. I like this move. This is a disaster a situation for Davis Mills to be walking into for this reason. One, he's only started 11 games in his entire career. Now, even though he played in an NFL-style system and he's got some good fundamentals and good, some good tools, he's also battled some injuries. And he's going to be playing behind a bad offensive line, a, a really a, a group of wide receivers that there's some decent pieces there, but not enough ultimately to help them. <clears throat> Excuse me, and their defense really needs to improve. So I, I'm on the opposite side of this spectrum. I'm not going to sit there and give it an F. I like Davis Mills. I just think he needs more time to develop. He doesn't need to be in a situation where he could potentially be thrusted into play, especially on a bad football but team. But he's not going to play. That's, he's going to sit. You talked about earlier. By the end of the Deshaun year, he'll be Watson, playing. Then he has to play. So he's going to be playing behind a bad, a bad offensive line and a bad team. This, to me, is a pick that I understand why they feel like they needed to make it. At the end of the day, though, it, it's, it's not going to work out well, I don't think, for any party involved. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.